this doesn't get spoken about enough. For me, it's basically colonialism still happening in the modern day. 14 of the France squad for Euro 2024 are illegible for African nations. Some people simply won't accept that black soccer players are actually French or actually European for other countries. And this is just blatant racism. The majority of those players were born in France, raised in France, and they learned to play soccer in France. And those that weren't actually born in France moved there usually at young ages, gained citizenship, and that's where they grew up and that's the culture that they know. French culture. But it's not just the French. Some England fans don't think their black players can be English either. Look at this. Remember when the English team had English players? Apparently, they're not really English. The comments get even worse. So few Englishmen, they should be in their own homelands representing their own countries. Where's the Englishmen? I see Africans and Afro-Caribbeans. It goes on to be worse. But here's the thing. This is just blatant racism and white supremacy, really. I mean... The fact of the matter is, is that nationality, race, and ethnicity are all three different things. The players on the French national team are French. The players on the English national team are English. Whether they're white, black, or even of Asian descent does not make them not that nationality. And frankly, this is the racism that we need to kick out of the game. The racism that we need to give the red card. But... Too many people are tied to these ethno and racial identities of what it means to be of one nationality or another. And that needs to die off. We need to get rid of that and we need to kick it out of the sport. It's not acceptable anywhere.